Congress in the state of Gujarat is resorting to desperate measures to win over voters. The party is trying hard to deflate the BJP's claims of a vibrant Gujarat. Now it seems it has goofed up though on its campaign on malnourishment in the state. And now what of words has begun with the BJP alleging that the Congress is misleading the people of the state of Gujarat. At the center of this controversy is this photograph on your screens of a skinny child in the arms of its mother. Now the Congress has used this photo in its campaign to back malnourishment statistics among children. But the BJP now says that this photograph has been lifted from the website of a Christian organization and is of a Sri Lankan flood victim. Now the Congress has refused to acknowledge that the photograph is indeed lifted. It has on the other hand accused the BJP of raking up non-issue when the focus has to be on the health of the kids. The ruling party says that it is misleading people with its falsified agenda. This is not the first time that the Congress, remember, has goofed up in its campaign on the state's kids. Now, State Congress President Arjun Modwarya was forced to take off a photograph of a child that he used for his blog of malnourishment in the state. The photograph was that of a child from Africa and was lifted from the UNICEF website. Bossi Acharya joins us for the latest on the story. A big goof up this by the Congress unit in the state of Gujarat, Mosigi. The BJP, of course, using the opportunity to turn the attack on them and take away the initiative. Well, absolutely. A huge embarrassment for the Congress here, where they have been caught on the wrong foot to uh, establish malnutrition in uh, Gujarat here. Arjun Bhadwadia, however, has uh, been forced to remove the photograph from his blog after the uproar. In fact, BJP is smiling from year to year. They have been forwarding this grouper to all the media men uh, since two days now, and they have forwarded this email to most of the people. They have been posting it on Facebook and Twitter using the social media to point out that how the Congress has been portraying a wrong picture here. Even Narendra Modi pointed out in one of his uh, campaign that how Congress was using wrong facts and figures to highlight uh, that BJP had not done enough mm -hmm. work. And now that there was a visual proof of uh, a huge blooper here to figure out the malnutrition, uh, Congress definitely has landed in a very embarrassing spot. And Mosiki, even more embarrassing, given that this hasn't happened for the first time. I mean, it's happened on a previous occasion as well. A picture lifted from the UNICEF website, put on Arjun Mudadia's blog. Something certainly needs to be done about this because, you know, they're losing the initiative in their, in their, in their foray against them and the party must take stock of the situation. Well, absolutely. Congress has definitely uh, uh, noted that this has uh, become a huge embarrassment, especially with polls not even one more month to go. And coming at this point of time, it is definitely going to dent their image where they have been advertising very, very strongly here that uh, BJP has misused the funds and that there was widespread malnutrition in the state here in Gujarat. Here. And now that when this ad has backfired on the Congress, they will have to work extremely hard to uh, reverse their image that they have been providing the correct facts to the people of Gujarat while they have been campaigning. Meanwhile, BJP here... Is, has landed in an extremely favorable spot here. They are happy that at the last point when the campaigning has just started, uh, this has uh, landed them a good opportunity to hit out Congress. They have been forwarding this email and trying to spread mm. the message that how Congress has given out wrong tax to the voters. And it has okay. been, uh, um, it has been called since a very, very long time here. So yes, at the last minute, First, it was Vichal Radhadeya's son uh, trotting MPs mm. uh, at the toll booth which landed Congress in a spot and later on Arjun Modwadeya And, and even from the, um, from the perspective of, of the campaign itself, on the other hand you have Narendra Modi, the Chief Minister, launching 3D campaigns appearing in 26 locations simultaneously. So certainly at this stage losing out on that front as well as the Congress party is something they need to take stock of for the moment. Thanks very much Mausiki for joining us with your input.